everyone in this video we are going to see the next type of your problems on trains let's see the question a train 270 meter long is moving at a speed of 25 km per hour it will cross a man coming from the opposite direction at a speed of 2 km per hour in how long the train take to cross a man man also running in opposite direction here distance of train is 270 meter and what is the speed of the train 25 km per hour we should convert this into meter per second so anyway here man speed also available because both are running both are in relative speed so moving objects 2 km per hour man speed is 2 km per hour we keep it time taken to cross the train to the man that is time is equal to distance divided by speed how we can calculate the speed and what is the distance 270 how we can calculate the speed we want to consider the both the speeds so if it is opposite direction means we should add both the speeds what is the speed here speed of train is 25 and speed of man is 2. So, while adding this 2 speed means we are getting 27. So, 27 kilometer per hour. We should convert this 27 kilometer per hour into meter per second. So, this is 1 time, this is 10 times and again this is 1 time, this is 2 5s are 10. So, 18 into 2 is 36 seconds. Time taken to crossing the man, the time is 36 seconds your option b is correct here we have one train and another one is man this is the case 3 example let's see the another question also this is your question a train 500 meter is long as moving at a speed of 70 kilometer per hour it will cross a man coming from the opposite direction at a speed of 20 km per hour. What is the train length? That is, distance of train is 500 meter. What is the speed of train? 70 km per hour. What is the, what is the speed of man? 20 km per hour. They are in the opposite direction. So, time is equal to distance of train divided by speed of train plus speed of man because both are in the opposite direction. So, time is equal to 2, sorry, time is equal to what is your distance here? 500 divided by what is your speed? 70 plus 20, 90. We should convert this 90 km per hour data into meter per second this is two times this is ten times and this is one times this is five times five fives are 25 time is equal to 500 by 25 hence this is one time this is two times hence they crossing each other in 20 seconds the train is crossing a man in 20 seconds your option d is correct now this is the example of your case 3 while that moving objects one is train and another one is man. So according to this questions we should add the both the speeds train speed as well as man speed. Thank you for watching.